around Nairobi has changed how business is conducted within the once rundown facilities. According to Housing and Urbanization PS, Charles Hinger, the upgrades commissioned by President Uru Kenyatta in 2018 were necessary to ensure a habitable place for an habitable pace for business people within the city. According to Hinga, who was touring some of the markets, this has enabled them to increase the number of traders and customers who are afraid to visit the markets due to the poor condition that they were in. The renovations and upgrades were done by the Nairobi Metropolitan Service together with the ministry at a cost of 2 billion Kenya shillings. The markets have benefited from this, or that have benefited from this, are City Park Market along Limuru Road, City Market, and the Gikomba Market. We have, uh, we have redone uh, the, the floors. They are now neat. We've done the drainage. We've done for them, uh, I think, two sets of ablution blocks on each wing, and then at the back, they used to call it the slum, eh, the shanties of city, city market. It was terrible. I wish I had the before and after uh, of what those traders uh, were exposed to, exposed to all manner of elements. But right now, as you can see, it will, it, it's very difficult to tell you that was a, a slum of, uh, of the market. So we're very, very, very proud of the work that has gone in here. And uh, we continue to uh, you know, work with the traders. There are a few snags uh, here and there that, uh, um, you know, any works that you do, there will be snags, which we've agreed with the chairman uh, we are going to undertake. 